Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. In this video, we will learn how to use one ALB for multiple applications. So generally we create our load balancer. We have seen in the previous video where Kubernetes ingress is creating a load balancer. But if you have 10 services, creating a 10 load balancers per service is not a cost effective solution. So for that, how we can assure or how we can expose multiple applications on one load balancer. So we will be deploying two services. So I have already deployed the Nginx service on my Kubernetes cluster. And the second, I will be deploying this game Kubernetes app, game application on my Kubernetes cluster. So here you can see I'm creating this namespace creating the deployment and creating the service here. So let's just go to my terminal and run this command kubectl apply hyphen f game. So it has created the namespace deployment and the service for this application. And now I have to create the ingress resource so previously we have seen that to create a one service one ingress resource for one application you are just using this ingress and this is how it works and there is no rules nothing like that so that by default your load balancer dns name will point to this particular service only now you have two services so how do we do that so if you look at to my this particular yaml file here you can see that difference i am using this group name so when you use the group name and you then it will just create one alb so for for how many services or for all the ingress resources wherever you are using my app it will just try to use this load balancer only and here you can see that I have created the same and the rules now I have put host nginx.com I have put it and then just same and for the second one I have used the same group name and the host is game.com so generally you have a route 53 entry so you can actually use your actual host name in this example I'm just using like this and then using mod header I will be testing it but this is just how the ingress looks like. So now let me just uh, run this command kubectl apply hyphen f ingress combines. So now you can see that it has created the ingress and if I do this kubectl get ingress hyphen a you can see for the nginx you can see that it has created this load balancer but not for the game.km because we are using the group name so it should not create the another load balancer so now let's go to our aws console so here you can see that it has it is creating one load balancer and if i look at the rules now you can see that it has already added both so it says that if your host header is nginx.com it will go to this target group and if it is host header is game.com then it will go to this target group so you can see that this is how it is exposing so now you can see our load balancer is active and if you look at the rules we have three rules based on the host header only it will go to this target group so how we can test is this now so i will test it locally using curl command but if you will have a proper route 53 entry then you can actually test it on the browser also but for now i will be going there and just running this command so here you can see curl hyphen h host this is called host header and you provide this nginx.com and this is your dns name so if i click on this so you can see that i got this page welcome to nginx and now my next is game.com so if I do host game.com and my DNS URL, I will get that. So this is all big game. So you get all the details. So this means that you can use one load balancer for multiple applications using path based filter and host header. You can 
route your request to the specific target groups and this is just one example where i am doing it using host header but you can have a multiple patterns there like path based filtering and host header there are a lot that you can explore